Harley. This trip requires the utmost concentration, we are riding along on one of the final engineering drives for the Mercedes-Benz E-Class convertible, a model Daimler calls the Cabriolet. At the wheel is Christian Fru, development chief for the coupe and convertible C and E-Class models. In another of several prototypes on this drive, the pilot is Peter Cole, testing chief for the new models. One car is a Europe spec E200 with a 181 horsepower turbocharged inline 4 making even less power than the 241 horsepower 4 found in the base US sedan, the E300. Another car has a 4 cylinder turbo diesel that's so quiet you would be forgiven if you confused it with a 6, but don't expect to see that at US dealerships, either. In the US, the convertible will be an E400, like the E-Class Coupe powered by a twin-turbo V6 gasoline engine. In the coupe it's rated at 329 horsepower and 354 pounds to foot of torque, and those figures are likely to be the same in the soft-top version. Note that the day of V8-powered E-Class convertibles appears to be past, our fond memories of the E550 Cabrio notwithstanding. Although the E63 sedan uses AMG's thundering 4.0-liter V8, the AMG version of this new cabriolet will most likely be an E50 powered by a turbocharged inline 6. Don't look for that one in the first couple of model years, though. Every E-Class convertible will come with Daimler's own 9-speed convention.